and gentlemen, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. My name is Andy Factor, and last time we did American Distillery taking down some moonshiners. 26% of story, 24% of total completion, not horrible, but Miss Molly wants to talk to me, which is always weird. So let's we'll see how this goes. What's up, Molly? Wait. Yes, Miss O'Shea. Ah, call me Molly, would you? Arthur, how is Dutch? I mean, how does he seem to you? I'm about the same as usual, I guess. I, I really love him, you know. But if he... Like he always says, loyalty is everything, so... Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. What you want? I bring a gift. The great gift of information. So you got some tip-off, so now... I can yeah. risk my neck and make you some money while you lounge around. You know, Arthur, bitterness, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so, but you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. What are you talking about? Arthur's above a little stick-up I heard about. No, I'm not. <laughs> you just said. Yeah, I'll do it, as long as you ride with us. Well, I got a serious medical condition. Yes, you are a compulsive liar. Uh, no need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? I hardly know you. Exactly. Now, you boys should do this. It, it's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Oh, God help me. Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> Well, what is it? It's a supply wagon carrying payroll, but very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church before it connects with the rest of the wagon train. Very easy picking. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. You are a sick man, Arthur Morgan. A very sick man indeed. But I don't care about him. I want to talk to the lady. Come on, then, you miserable bastards. You never really talked to her. How do you get wind of this, old man? We only been down here all of five minutes. <laughs> wow, you boys been off fishing, playing lawman, or whatever the hell you've been doing. I've been getting down to business. <laughs> Finding the nearest grog house. Hey, you don't want in on this, Williamson. That's fine by me. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will you? I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee-high to a grasshopper. Once a decade, maybe. So what is it you scoped here exactly? Well, I told you. There's a wagon with a lockbox passes through every week. They switch outriders just north of here, but the front wagon's by itself for a stretch before the last run down in the road. <laughs> Okay, hold up here. We should Wait, we're gonna hold up here? Oh, they'll be passing through the crossroads up ahead. Wind. Soon, Williamson. Christ's sakes. I should be doing. Oh, Corbon, Lancaster. Do. Lancaster and. Any time now. Let's keep this quiet and clean. Nobody needs to die here. Bear! You see, gentlemen? <laughs> Just like clockwork. <laughs> Why don't we do this right in front of our camp? Stop the wagon! I said, stop the damn wagon! Whoa! Now, don't try anything stupid! And we won't do anything unkind. You know, boys, I, I don't, I don't want to get shot, but this is a mistake. I work for Cornwall Kerosene and Tar, Mr. Oh, Leviticus great, Cornwall. Cornwall. Oh, great. So, you know him? <laughs> Who doesn't? I hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around and not miss it too much. Oh, he'll miss it. Shit! Hey! I think I see something! Oh, great. Let's go! Arthur, let's go! Yeah! Oh my god! There's a whole lot of them back there! Come on! We need to lose them! 
We're not supposed to shoot anybody in Rhodes. Why was there four behind everybody? Where the hell are we going? Getting out of here! What kind of dumb questions? Keep going! We're losing them! Yeah. Until dark, and then we'll sneak out of here. Charles, you keep watch for now. Sure. Well, we uh, get some rest. Yeah. Dang it, Uncle! You had one job. All right. <clears throat> Let's try and get out of here. Hey, shit! Absolutely. Shut up, old man. Well, look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light over by the house. Damn. Get out here. Get I ain't in Let's I just keep this there. calm. See what there. happens. Is this your place? Kinda. Uh, and you didn't hear well. nothing? I... I... Why don't you just tell me, partner, what you heard? I, I, tell me what you heard. I don't... Uh, maybe I, I heard some noises out by the barn a while ago. It ain't me. It better not be. All right. Coop forth. Lo, go check out the, the barn. Uh, sir. <clears throat> I might want to move. Well, the place looks deserted enough. Sure. You head inside, I'll go around the back. Place looks empty to me. Now, the old guy up there is full of crap. I don't think they're here. Don't see any horses. Come on, let's head back. Boss! Place is empty! Shit! Uncle! Give him hell, boys! Oh, oh boy.
do the hat. Let me get in there. How about we stop robbing Cornwall for a while? I didn't know we were robbing Cornwall, all right? Dummy that started this idea. Where are we going, Bill? We'll try to lose him in the woods. They uh, split up a bit. Try to confuse him. Arthur, with it, me. Dang, this is a dark forest. Quick. Let me see you with the knife. Let's go. Yeah, that's part of the reason why I did that. Only like throwing knobs. I don't even have throwing knobs. Up eventually, losing this many men against four we people. Still alive. Yeah. Just about. Yeah, I'll deal with you later. We got some money, didn't we? Sure, but now we got corn on our back. It was an honest hey, mistake. Hey, leave it, Guan. Get out of here. Every man split up, Guan. Run quick. Good luck, Johnson. Stay quiet and move. Dang. It was not an honest mistake, but. Woo! Where are we? Oh, we're right where our fishing spot was. In the middle of nowhere. Fence? I think it's a fence. Alright, so guys, next time on Red Dead Redemption 2, we have two options, which is Lenny or GR. Actually, I think we're going to go to Rhodes first to see what we can find there. I'll see you guys then.